Come out, Yoko. An animal who is covered in spikes. Do you know who it is, my friends? A hedgehog. Well done, my friends. Just wait here. I'll be back. Aha! Uh -huh. She likes hide and seek, but I'm very good at that game. I think she's over here. Over here. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny. Louie! I'm over here. Don't worry, Yoko. To draw a hedgehog, I start with his pointed head. And then I add two dots for his eyes, and a line for his mouth, and a circle for the snout. And now I draw his ears, a semicircle, and then another one on the top of his head. But where are his spikes? On his back. So I draw some points. So that he's scary as possible, I'll give him even more spikes. <laughs> After, I add his back paws, like two little boots, a line for his tummy and his two front paws. That's it. He's all finished. Not yet, Yoko. First, we have to... Colour him in. Uh, hello. My name is Julian. Hello, hello Julian. There, Julian. Julian. There's a slug who is eating up our lettuces. Could you find her? Oh, I'm so scared. Help. 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 But, but Help. what's happened? Julian? Julian! He's hiding, Yoko. But what for? Well, hedgehogs roll up in the pool to protect themselves from danger. The slug is scary. Oh, I'm leaving. Louie? Do you think you could draw us a hedgehog that is braver? Of course, Yoko. Let's do it. To draw a hedgehog, you start with his pointy head. You add two dots for his eyes, a line for his mouth, and a circle for his snout. Next, you draw the ears, two semicircles. For his back, you add lots of little points for his spikes. You draw his two back paws, his tummy, and his two front paws. When you have finished, you can colour him in however you like. Hello there. My name's Inspector Bruno. Hello, Hello Inspector, Inspector Bruno. Bruno. So what have we got going on here? Stolen flowers? Disappearing vegetables? Hmm. I assume that you are the witnesses. Is there a suspect? Yes, a slug. She's eating all the lettuces in hmm. our garden. 
So, are you going to scare her with your spikes? Oh, no. A real inspector wouldn't do that at all. We observe, and we think. You'll see. Mm -hmm. First clue. She's been over here, and then she's been uh, over there, yeah. A slug's trail and fresh teeth marks. I believe that she's... Right here. <laughs> you can't escape the nose of Inspector Bruno. Stop! I'm only a helpless little garden slug. I'll tell you the honest truth. I promise, I promise. So then, it was you who ate all of Louie and Yoko's lettuces. Yes, but I didn't eat very much at all. I just bit a little leaf here and a little leaf there. I can't help it. I'm always hungry. But if you're hungry, we can let you have a whole lettuce. But only one, though. <laughs> this one. Just for me? Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> but you must never, ever touch any of the other lettuces again, kiddo. You got it? It's a deal. So mm. there you go. It's much, much better to solve your problems with your head than with your spikes. It's an inspector's motto. <laughs> You're right. Thank you, Inspector Bruno. And now, if you'd like to draw a hedgehog, have a go. See you soon, friends. See you soon, Louie. See you soon, Yoko. Mm.